Hi, every hi folks. Hi everyone. Uh, I have an important announcement. Uh, I'll put the link, the, I'll put the time code below uh, if you want to skip and you don't want to listen to me uh, talking. Um, but I would prefer if you did not do that because this is important. Last week, me and my mum met this lovely lady called Ness. She's doing a Land's End to John O'Groat cycle, which if you don't know, it's from top to bottom of the whole of uh, the Great Britain island. And she's going to be raising money for the Brain Tumor Charity. While I'm filming this, I have nearly 62,000 people who might be watching this. I thought I, it would be good for me to promote this uh, in a video. Fire alarm. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. And you're not really fine. You just can't get into it because they. We are back and uh, everyone's fine. Someone just burnt their dinner. I felt that I should. Uh, that this would be a good way for me to promote this by talking about this in a video real quickly um, because she's raising money for the Brain Shaming Charity. As I said, I have a bandana here with the, that written on it. And this charity is very important to me because they uh, basically uh, saved my mum's life. When I was about like, four years old, she was diagnosed with a brain tumour and it was a ogliodendroglioma. Ogliodendroglioma. It had bits of the tumour were branching out into the brain and it was kind of in a like a mesh kind of form. She couldn't get brain surgery to get it cut out because that would involve taking out a bit of her brain and obviously that was not really an option. There was no treatment available for her so she just had to live with it for a good 10 years uh, and she was living with seizures, very frequent seizures. I think that a couple in each week it was that it was that frequent and me and my dad had to kind of get used to having to look after her and when she was having her seizures which isn't really anything anybody should have to get used to. And then in 2013, uh, after one of her scans, uh, they discovered that it was growing, which meant it was malignant, which meant that it had become cancerous, and so she had to undergo treatment right away. And luckily, there was now, at that point, a treatment available for her because of charities like the Brain Tumor Charity who fund research into these treatments. And she got radiotherapy, um, which just targeted the specific area and her seizures stopped immediately and it basically just killed off all the cancer cells uh, and she's been tumour free ever since in all of her um, scans there's been no sign of the tumour and uh, without that treatment I don't think she'd be with us today so that's why I want to urge you guys to check out Ness and her charity um, cycle ride. This is her card that she gave to me when we met her. My mum found it through Facebook because my mum actually also did the Le Jog cycle from Land's End to Groats. Um, the other way, sorry. And so she was really uh, happy to see somebody doing the same ride as she had done for this amazing cause. She's cycling 969 miles and so she wants to collect names for every mile names of people who have brain tumours or have had brain tumours and are now cured or for people who have even died from brain tumours and she wants to dedicate every single mile to each of those people. So if you know anybody who's had experiences with brain tumours, uh, send them to her on her Facebook page. Uh, I'll put links in the description but this is, uh, it won't focus, I'll put links in the description. And yeah, please see if you can donate anything to her and her amazing uh, cycle. Oh, make sure when you put your guitar on, your, your thousand pound guitar, smash it against the wall. Make sure you do that every single time for, uh, for the best results. Hi guys, it's actually um, uh, the next day now because when I filmed my cover uh, yesterday, I was, I, I was a dummy and I uh, had the gain on too high so all of the audio was distorted so we're gonna do this again. Lost 
to aching guts they tear through each other in the mirror this happy vacation there's no motivation to hold me up you see you want to chase the moon like fire well together we can fake your own desert just want to be alone and watch as you all just disappear oh, oh, oh. D -d darker now kicked out and sleeping in your car you roll the window down enough to dream and make believe our lights knocked out turned up upside down i'm just a stupid motherfucker can't figure it out i want several hearts i want to breathe in your rush i want to leap when you want me to fly darling i don't mean a bag but these thorns on the stair are nearly tearing up my skin you see you wanna chase the moon like fire well together we can fake your own death's air just wanna be alone and watch as you all just disappear Selling daylight for gasoline. So now we're gonna chase the moon like fire, yeah. Together we can fake your own death's air. Just wanna be alone and watch as you all just disappear. Oh. You have no idea how many t takes that took for me to get a, f a full take right, and I don't, still don't even feel it's good enough. <sighs> but I did it in one take. Thanks for watching my cover of Floral and Fading by Pistavel. It's a good one. Uh, I, I think I'm uh, destroying my voice with these high screamy notes, but... I'm doing it for the for music. I'm doing it for music. So yeah, thanks again for watching. Make sure to check out uh, the Nessa's um, cycling Facebook thing for the Brain Tumor Charity. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Through each other in the mirror